Turning now to 11 Alive's Ariana Moniz. Ariana, talking about staying indoors, that's not possible for everybody. People are turning to those COVID era masks when they head outside, but will that actually work? That's right, Aisha. We are seeing more people wear masks. We're about a mile away from the BioLab plant, the epicenter of where all this started. And as smoke and smog continues to linger in the air, residents here in Rockdale County, they want to know how can they protect themselves and if wearing a mask will help. But we're learning that surgical and KN95 masks, they won't do much against the chlorine that's in the air here in Conyers. The CDC says the masks do not protect against chemicals, gases, or vapors, which go right through the mask and mass manufacturer 3M says you need a full respiratory mask that protects against acid glass acid gas for chlorine. Meanwhile, residents, as you mentioned, they are continue to be told to stay inside. We spoke to a resident who lives two miles from BioLab on Zoom as she's sheltered in her home, who says that the air is still hazy with chemicals around where she lives and she had to be sent home from work after she says she started choking and gagging. Take a listen. All you can smell is nothing but chlorine, like straight bleach. Even now, like what, almost three days later, I'm still tasting and smelling bleach. And my chest is still hurting. It's extremely hard for us to be able to go out and like go to work. Now, the Georgia Protection Environmental Division and the EPA says the levels of chlorine that are being detected in the air, they are not high enough to harm anyone. Meanwhile, that news is not stopping law firms from filing class action lawsuits on behalf of residents here in Rockdale County. Reporting live from Rockdale, I'm Ariana Menise for 11 Alive. Back to you.